Hello guys, today we're gonna be building the rest of our passenger port as you see in front of you and in the background we uh, added a lot a lot of new houses so that will be part of today's video. If you like to see the rest and how everything was built today, uh, stay to the end and I will see you in a minute. So as you see in, in this uh, quick intro we have added a couple of things to our uh, port uh, and uh, let me just show you how all those things were done so first of all we have a couple of trees in here so that's the first thing we need to remove uh, from uh, our build just for now they will be added on so don't worry uh, we're not destroying uh, absolutely everything uh, the only thing it's uh, uh, all those trees they won't be uh, helpful to uh, do what we're trying to do so let's just uh, remove that uh, trees which no no there we go that's away and from uh, bushes uh, bushes could be okay uh, I don't like this tree and conifer will be absolutely fine as well so let's just keep that uh, so now when we have all the uh, clean state in here uh, let's just uh, remove that part uh, come on and I would like to pick you there we go, and we're gonna we're remove them. The universe here today on so now we have to make a bit of a clearance. Uh, first of all, uh, this part in here, it's not exactly as I would like it to be. I would like to smooth, smooth the terrain a bit. Oh my goodness. And now. Oh, there we go. A nice, nice gentle slope. I uh, would like to. Uh, what I would like to do in here, uh, I would like to level this terrain uh, just to have a bit more sense what kind of a heights we're dealing with uh, they're not looking good but don't worry we get there we get there okay and i think i would like to uh, lower this down to that height yeah that looks much much better uh, the first thing i would like to add in here see like with our uh, new DLCs, we have a uh, couple of uh, options, oh, sorry, I'll just move, uh, there we go, with our shopping malls, I would like to use this one, uh, and the reason for it, it looks like a couple of uh, different shops uh, combined together, uh, and I actually quite like that, and that, uh, the height is not as much as this, so this will dominate everything else uh, one second quick save uh, so that's looking good the only thing we need to add in here uh, we have this lock uh, like so locking docking uh, part on this side and for this what i would like to use i'm gonna use one u road uh, like this one and uh, I don't need any snapping at all and I would like to add this road in there and now we can move it a bit and change the height of it to that height there we go and what I would like to use now with our tools and mods we have this uh, building spawn points uh, so what we're gonna do uh, we're gonna duplicate 
copy point, duplicate point, and we're gonna remove everything except taxi from here. And we're gonna remove taxi from here. So see this point, uh, I'm gonna move it slightly so we can see which one is it. So this point will go in there. And we're gonna make this with 90 degrees angle. And this one, that's a taxi point, we can have you there. Uh, but again, I would like to have you with 90 degrees angle. So that means everything that is coming into that store will be delivered to the back of it and the taxis will be loading in here, which is perfect. So uh, what we have, we have this uh, shopping mall, we have a couple of parking spaces in here. Uh, I don't think I want to add anything in here, maybe uh, some kind of a plaza and again uh, we can use our uh, plazas DMCs which was uh, this one and uh, no there no there no there sorry uh, we have them here and I think that was this Plaza DNCs, that's too big, that's much better. All of them are quite massive, I want something smaller. So I think we're gonna make our own one. So we can have this statue in here. I can use our brush, there we go, we can add a couple of paths like that, so that will make it walkable, and then if I go again to our plazas DLCs, we can have a couple of nice features in here. So let's see what we can add. Uh, again, the brush size. So, a couple of benches. They lay you down on their operating table and what? Something sensible like pink tissue and bone samples? Remove your skull? No! And I would like to have. Human obsession. We got stores, whole aisles, and display pieces full of products dedicated to the endeavor. Something. That's on us. Where are the props? Uh, there we go. Couple of nice props I would like to use. I forgot about that. That's. Africa DLCs. Uh, let's just see in here if there's anything nice we can use. Uh, to make this a bit nicer. That's actually quite nice looking thing. But I don't want it in here. I'm thinking uh, that would be good. A bit of shadow. Oh, I know what we can add in here. We can use this item. There we go. Oh, that looks nice. And we can use couple of uh, flowers from uh, this DLC one two and 
this color. Just to have something as a focal point, and then we can use a couple of trees on this side just to hide this nasty connection there. Okay, and we can hide this entrance like this. In this case, actually, I want to have this visible, which is fine, but this not maybe, maybe not exactly the best choice. And then having this, we can use a couple of nice paths uh, just to have this uh, connection straight through. So if I add this as a freeform tool, like that, and I would like to have you go up there as well. Perfect. And maybe this connection here. And I would like to have a path through. The only thing is I don't know if I'm actually going to use it. So what we're going to do, we actually going to force them to do so. Let's just remove that connection. And we're going to have this path coming there. Perfect. And the straight line coming in here. And we can actually move it slightly there so that will give us a nice connection straight through that will give us more visitors and now we can go to our uh, commercial site pizza hat that would be actually quite cool to have you close. Um, McDonald's. Uh, I think I'm gonna stay with this pizza hat. Because that would be good to have like in there. And then we can use our movement and have you like in here. There we go. So now having this couple of things, so we have small uh, coffee house in here. We have quite a few people using our shortcuts, which is brilliant. Uh, we have our pizza hut in here as a commercial part. Uh, what else we can add using Rico? Something bigger. Uh, oh my goodness me, that's a massive. Mm. Let's just see if there's anything I can use to improve quality in here. Quick save. There is a couple of stores I know I have, um, but I would like to use something a bit smaller. A bit of a commercial, like wall-to-wall -wall buildings uh, would be good. So if I go there, if I go to Global, and if I go to DLC and if I go to shopping malls
we can have one in there and something small on the opposite side that would be actually quite cool to have something in here let's just see how it's gonna look like italian leather italian threading pernu is italian for jean jacket uh, probably yes the only thing if i can remove the trash can from it if i can remove that then yes no trees so let's just see trash uh, i would like to remove that trash yes okay that's gonna look much much nicer because that means we have this coffee house sitting on this slope in here which is brilliant that's exactly what i would like to have uh, we have this coffee house uh, nothing major on the side we have our small pizza hut in here which is absolutely fine so now what i can do i can go to our uh, that's maybe too much uh, I can go to our landscaping tools and we can add a bunch of flowers in here just to hide it a bit and something a bit taller like this So we're not gonna have like kind of a brick wall in here there we go that looks all right that's on this side on this side we're gonna go for medium trees but i'd like to have some color so i'm gonna use that then using chestnut tree i'm gonna make this selection no 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 no, no. i don't want to why it's changed uh, let's reset the object mm, i don't like this one no i like the other one which was this perfect that's exactly what i want to see and there we go don't change and just stay as it is uh, I mean, if it's pharmacy, and um, don't think it looks like pharmacy, which is fine. Uh, I quite like the shape of the building, the, the, the option we have those uh, chairs on the top, which is fine. Uh, we can have a couple of small bushes on the back. And I'm going to use move it. Why well, can't move you for some reason? Uh, let's just try again. There we go. that's much nicer and couple of trees nothing nothing major just a couple of trees 
because we have trees in here why oh my goodness i forgot to select historical oh that's awful that's absolutely awful there we go and we're gonna select historical building there we go that's what i want to see of course this slope in here it's not looking the best but what we gonna do in here uh, we're gonna add a couple of bushes in here just to lose that and we're gonna add our tree in there okay that's looking much better now uh, of course what we need to do we need to add a couple of trees to this side but i would like to add this one this one and something bigger on this side just to cover the fact that there is a massive cargo and train terminal up there okay and we can add three in here and with this green top it's actually looking quite good so i think i'm gonna leave it like that maybe a couple of smaller trees like in here and all behind just to have this separated one to another there we go as much as we can that will be probably a good call to have something like this uh, in there and in here all i need is just to add a couple of white flowers uh i don't need dlc uh orange yellow so a couple of different flowers scattered around all over the place some bushes that will be good to have uh, just to take off your eye from uh, there we go it's probably i can add one two three four and couple on here just to hide all of that nastiness behind perfect that's absolutely fine i don't want to you know have like a proper forest in here and using this open air mall we just have it like a couple of separate stores in here which actually looking quite quite good so we have this part filled in uh yeah that's looking much much better than just like a plain um uh, grass area or anything like that so okay this part that's staying as it is it's just like a rough uh uh, port construction side that's all uh, filled in so we can just leave it as it is uh, a bit of a, a passenger harbor and now the next thing we need to focus today uh, will be adding some more people because i will show you again uh, with our population we have 22,000 jobs still uh, to fill in so basically filling that in we have massive residential demand so what i did last episode i just added like a um, 
bare bones to to our uh, uh, neighborhood in here and all we need to do just now is just to add a couple of uh, uh, residential houses so what i would like to do is i'm gonna make this as a district there we go uh, and having this as a district uh, we will try to add a couple of houses in here and we have the main roads added on so we can add the rest uh, quite easy uh, let's just remove that part I want to have this like this okay that's a second district see those uh, there we go those train tracks that's a problem for the community that's why we have uh, those two connections in here this one is actually too uh, wide I would say uh, it should be a bit smaller uh, but it's very popular and I'll show you why you can see that's a lot of working spaces so all those people uh, from our city are actually going there to work uh, which telling me that probably uh, we should have some kind of like a bus uh, connection going in there uh, maybe but first let's just do uh, and fix our neighborhood in here uh, Florence Square no uh, uh, we're gonna change our naming to uh, let's just go for hills because as you can tell we will be pretty close to that part in here so having the main roads in uh, i'm gonna again use our standard roads we have been using in here uh, like for example those ones uh, and we can have more um, division in between so let me just do that uh, and I get back to you in a second.
So as you see, we have uh, all the road layouts sorted. Uh, I have connection in here between two neighbor so neighborhoods. I think I need one more in here because we have this uh, the bridge in here, like viaduct in here, uh, and we probably need mo one more connection in here. So uh, let me just add it on, and I can show you how. <clears throat> I actually make them so see if I go to uh, sorry this way if I go to my road tools like path tools uh, what I'm gonna do I'm gonna start with this and I would like to use this one just because it's it looks just a bit more natural so what I will do I'm gonna go for at least seven meters in height and I would like to have this connection straight in here so that will give uh, there we go and then that will give us this path then what I will do I will go slightly lower like there uh, just to have the maximum height uh, as much as you need I don't need anything more than that so we're gonna go for connection uh, maybe like in here like there and I would like to have one connection like here will be good so see if we go to your connection tools you can have Oh my goodness me. Uh, no, I don't want that con that kind of a connection. I would like to have this uh, curve tool. That will be... Oh, come on, behave. See, that's the thing I don't really like. No. If I go for that connection, if I go for that connection, so what we can do now, we can make this like that, and we can make you like this. So I want this to be with an angle. There we go it just looks so much nicer uh, if that's the right height I will say so we can also do this so what I'm gonna do I'm going to every single node and I'm actually changing the stretch to 70% that means this looks more natural to me because when you have this at 70 percent uh, the path is still enough for all the people to go through but it just look uh, a touch smaller and I think I need to change this uh, height a bit uh, let's just go for that because it looks a bit odd like sitting like this There we go. So that will give us connection between those two neighborhoods. And when we have all sorted like that, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna hit play and we're gonna see all those things happening. But before I do that, I would like to have a bus lane. So what I will do, I'm gonna go to buses. I'm gonna go to bus lane. I would like to have Dr. Bus lane going all. I hold a degree in astrophysics, but my primary focus is, 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 is interdimensional mental projection. Around. So you can't use 
this neighborhood so it's gonna pick up every single soul we can have in here and that's one thing the other thing it's gonna boost our houses and there we go and what kind of a buses we would like to have in it so that will be the very last one uh, not this uh, very last one bus line created uh, there we go 17 and I would like to have 30 something a bit more uh, 50 70 uh, that's too much that's too much 115 I quite like this one that will be actually good so 60 and how many buses we gonna have on the line nine uh, I will go for six six buses on the line and of course we need a connection going the other way so clockwise and anti-clockwise just to give them more options to go to the main city go to the like a city center and of course go to the high school as well which we have on this side complete, complete the line so we had line 17 with the i think it was the very last one which was this and in this case six will be absolutely plenty i will say even four for now uh, 17 18 and we're gonna go for four on this line as well because the first uh, couple of months that will be just like empty plots and things like that so that's all we have in here so we have a bit of a commercial uh, we have a bit of a uh, uh, as you see uh, well, I don't have anything in here uh, I just added on I probably was thinking about the noise it's gonna make but listen, it is absolutely fine uh, I mean that's the thing it's probably missing uh, you know mixed use to, will be absolutely brilliant to have uh, within the game but uh, we can have everything so let's just stay with that and what I'm gonna add as well I'm gonna add a couple of trees and a couple of larger trees because this part uh, won't be used for any any construction and we have nice water source on this side <coughs> so any hiking activity uh, that will be absolutely brilliant uh, to have so if I do this go just to have you know an, an option for them to do something in there uh, and you can make this as a park as well like a city park so people are actually gonna start using it uh, more often for now it's absolutely fine we just need to see more uh, building so let's just uh, put this uh, into the uh, time lapse and I get back to you as soon as we have more houses.
so as you see our city uh, grown a lot we have uh, all most of the buildings um, already in uh, we have high um, residential demand so uh, all the plots are uh, uh, done uh, there was a couple of things i changed like for example i changed to this lower uh, i mean it's a still high school but like a lower height of it uh, just to uh, fit the, the theme of the neighborhood a bit more and also what i did uh, i changed this uh, um, road access and now as you see trains are going under there was a connection here but was blocked most of the time uh, because the junction was just too close so what i did i created a connection uh, a raise up connection and we have path uh, just under uh, with for access for all the people going to uh, maybe some shopping at IKEA maybe uh, some uh, employees to go to uh, Volkswagen uh, dealership in here so that's uh, working really well and I help a lot with traffic I have uh, those asymmetric roads in here just to give them uh, a easy access and better um, uh, way to to go to all the directions uh, that I want to go so um, that will be it for today I'm gonna jump into uh, this section just to show you uh, the stations working really well uh, actually two of them combine but we have this uh, yeah, access path to the other side in case if it's needed uh, taxi stands are looking quite uh, good so uh, that's really nice to have uh, and um, i hope to see you next time uh, when we're gonna add more uh, into our city uh, the one thing I would like to show you uh, is uh, what I have in plan for this. Uh, I want to put some like a small island uh, place. Uh, uh, then I was thinking about adding a massive city on this side just because we need probably about 50 60 thousand people. Uh, to add to our region some farms on this side couple of factories to provide goods but i would like to have oil industry here uh, and a small town to provide some employment for it uh, and i think we can have nice uh, access with the motorway uh, to do so there will be a junction coming this one here uh, that's just the access to the outside world but we need to add those uh, things in here and a couple of farms uh, and uh, maybe a small coast town, town village on this side a part of that region it's uh, doing quite well uh, i'm really pleased with it and uh, we still have a lot to do on that side of the map uh, so I will see you next time and thank you so much for watching. Uh, quick uh, summary at the end uh, and that was pleasure as always. Bye bye. Thank you very much for watching today. If you like the channel I hope you stay for the next episode and uh, thank you so much it was privileged to have you today and was good episode couple of um, things added on and uh, if you want to stay tuned with uh, more content uh, hit the like button hit the bell and i will see you next time bye bye